I'm Jesse Moy with Groves Incorporated, and in this video, we're going to talk about some of the equipment storage options Groves Incorporated has to offer. Since 1980, Groves has been a leader in storage solutions, and after pioneering the open air turnout gear storage system to help support the fire and safety industry, Groves expanded on its ReadyRack product line to include a wide variety of other storage racks, not just for your turnout gear, but for your hose, your SCBA, and other loose equipment. You know, just like cleaning your gear, storing your gear properly is just as important. And by storing your gear correctly, you can essentially keep it safe and extend the life of the gear. So let's start where it all began, with the original Ready Rack open air turnout gear storage system. Even after 40 years, the original ready rack system is still a viable option for storing your turnout gear. Now the basis of the design of the ready rack system was to allow maximum airflow through the locker. This way a firefighter could hang damp gear and it would dry faster and breathe naturally. As opposed to say like a gym or school style cubby hole type of locker where if you put damp gear in there it'd be all crammed up, it can't breathe, you're going to build up mildew and it's going to get stinky and muggy, okay? With our system, the air flows through and allows your gear to breathe. Now, I'm standing in front of a wall-mounted ready rack system, but we also make a freestanding or a mobile system on wheels so you can move it around. Now, each system has a top shelf and a bottom shelf, um, label holder, and hanging rod, okay? Also, What's great feature about these ready rack systems is that if I'm looking to put, say, a lot of lockers in a very limited space, and we all know how much fire stations are limited on space, I can do that with this ready rack system. I can make smaller locker compartments if I want to. Now, I'm, st I'm looking at a 24 inch wide right here, but I could make 18, I could make a 16, I could even go down to a 12 inch wide locker compartment if I have to, and it's all about where I position these divider panels, okay? They're not welded in here. I can position them wherever I want. If I want to make a smaller compartment, I can. If I want to make a larger compartment, I can. So it's flexible in that way. I've been in a fire station still to this day that have these original ready rack systems, and even after decades of use, they're still holding up strong. So after the original ready rack system, we expanded the line, like I was saying before, and we came out with the Red Rack system, which probably most of you know us for. So let's go over there and I'll talk a little bit about those. Just like the Ready Rack, the Red Rack's design is to allow maximum airflow through the locker. Now the Red Racks are a little bit more robust than the original Ready Rack, and as you can see, they're constructed a little bit differently. You still get all the great standard items like a helmet shelf, boot shelf, label holder, hanging rod, and apparel hooks. And when it comes to the size of the lockers, our standard widths are 24, 20, and 18 inch wide. All 20 inches deep. However, we do get some requests for 24 inch wide, 24 inch deep lockers, and yes, we can do it. The different variations of the red rack are going to be the same as the ready rack. We have wall mounted, mobile single sided and double sided and freestanding lockers in the single sided or double sided options. Now let me talk about some of the things that separate the red rack lockers from some of the other locker options that are out there on the market. Probably most noticeable would be the open back of the locker. Our lockers do not come standard with a rear grid panel. Whether you're going to need the rear grid panel or not will probably come down to what type of wall you're mounting the lockers on. If you're mounting the lockers to say a studded wall that has sheetrock or drywall, then you might want the rear panel to help protect the wall from getting damaged. But if it's a masonry, brick, cinder block wall, then the rear grid panel isn't totally necessary. Really, all the rear grid panel is doing is obstructing your wall. Without the rear panel, I can clean or repaint my walls without having to take down the entire locker system. Or let's say I have electrical outlets on my wall. Now I have easy access to them, okay? 
Another difference would be our unique construction of the lockers. Each locker compartment has its own individual back frame. And when it comes to wall mounted or freestanding single sided lockers, it really makes a locker run limitless. I could build a single locker run with 100 compartments if you have the wall space for it. We build down the run one locker at a time. This also allows the customer then to add on additional lockers one locker at a time or even take down lockers one locker at a time you know, to create more wall space. So I don't have to take down an entire locker system if I'm going to make adjustments or rearrangements in my fire station. When it comes to our mobile red rack lockers, we use a super duty constructed base with a five inch heavy duty caster on it connected to a welded on caster plate. Some of those other mobile locker systems you'll see out there use a stem style or peg style type of caster. And when you have that on a heavy duty locker system and you're rolling across the floor and let's say you hit a crack in the floor, you always have the potential of that snapping off. So those are just some of the things that separate the red racks from the other competition out there. When it comes to accessories, there's a lot of great options that you can add to your locker system. We offer a security option for all of our red rack locker systems. What's great is you could get our lockers now and later on down the road, retrofit them with the security option if you'd like. Now, if you don't want the door, but you still wanna be able to lock up some small valuables, we have our personal property box. Also, we have a wide variety of hangers for your locker system from our heavy duty flat dry hanger to our dry quick hanger. Dry quick hanger is nice because it opens up the jacket a little bit so you can get some air on the inside to let it breathe. We also have a glove dry hanger that doubles as a hood hanger and of course we have some helmet holders as well. Another option for the red rack lockers is custom colors. Now obviously red is the most popular color in the fire industry but we can do other colors if you'd like. Black, yellow, green, blue, etc. Okay. Another great option you could add to your red rack lockers, and this goes back to safely taking care of your gear, is our gear guard cover. You know, the number one cause for turnout gear degradation is actually UV lighting. Now, if you have your turnout gear lockers somewhere in the fire station, near a window, or let's say the bay doors where the sunlight is hitting the gear all day long, those fibers in that gear are going to break down faster than a set of gear that's not in direct sunlight. Groves has designed a heavy duty PVC laminate that is antimicrobial and self deodorizing. Now each locker compartment is gonna have two zippers next to it. So if I need to gain access, I don't have to flip open the entire gear guard cover. I undo two zips and open up the flap and I have easy access to one compartment. Just another great option to be able to take care of your turnout gear. Now, let's get into some of the other equipment storage options Groves Incorporated has to offer. Now I'm standing in front of a handful of great equipment storage racks. Over here I have our mobile workstation. Comes in a two section or three section work table. Great for fixing and repairing items in the firehouse. Can store bottles, has flat shelving. Over here we have our mobile bottle cart for storing a little or a lot of bottles. This is our 16 bottle rack, but we go all the way up to a 48 bottle rack. Behind me, our multi-purpose storage system, also known as the MPSS. What I love about this rack is I can customize the shelving on here to fit my fire station's needs. So if I wanted to do all hose shelving on here, if I wanted to do all bottle shelving or all air pack uh, storage, I can do that. If I want to mix it up, I can do that as well. It's great. It's versatile and flexible. Over here, the SOS rack. Kind of similar to the MPSS because of the versatility, but on a larger scale. It's a 32 inch deep compartment on the SOS rack, which is great for storing gear bags or even let's say 
longer air tanks like scuba tanks, okay? So kind of like the MPSS, but bigger. As you can see, uh, these racks that we have here are fantastic for fire stations because basically you could customize your own unit with any type of shelving that you want to fit your needs. Now some other host storage options we have outside of the SOS and the MPSS is our mobile heavy duty hose carts. Let's go over there. These carts are built strong. You could probably back a fire engine into one of these carts and it won't break on you. I'm not saying to do that. I'm just saying that's how strong they are. For the host storage options, we have here our two tier hose cart with the 64 inch long ledges, but it can come in a three tier option. And for more storage capacity, we have a two tier or three tier hose cart option with the 96 inch long ledges. For hose rolling, our small diameter hose winder. What's great about this, it can attach to any upright on our heavy duty mobile hose carts. We also have our LDH large diameter hose winder right here. Behind me, the mobile hose drying rack. Great for hanging a lot of hose and it's mobile so you can move it around the station, small footprint size, you can put it away when you're not using it. All of these hose carts that you see right here are built to stand up to the rigorous lifestyle that's demanded in the firefighting industry, built to last. So as you can see, Groves Incorporated has a lot of different equipment storage options to offer. And to recap, our equipment racks are stronger, safer, user-friendly, design-friendly, customizable, and there to keep your fire station gear safe and well-organized. We stand behind our products. If you have any questions or need further information, reach out to Groves Incorporated or visit readyrack.com. Thank you.